Hello and welcome to Don Bennett's Drum Vault. Hey, today we've got a very unique show. I'm sitting here with a collection of Stan Lynch's gold and platinum records. Uh, as you may know, Stan Lynch was the drummer in Tom Petty and the Heartbreakers. Uh, he was with the band from the very beginning until about 1994. As you probably know, Tom Petty and the Heartbreakers is one of the biggest bands in the world. Uh, they have sold, get your head around this, 50 million albums. That's just, it, it's hard to even uh, comprehend that. This collection of gold and platinum records uh, sort of mark and chronicle uh, that career that Stan had with Tom Petty. Uh, and each of these sort of serves as a little milestone uh, of his career along the way. Tom Petty, you know, when he left, a lot of people would think that was a great career and you could be pretty good right there to be done. But really for Stan, he was really just getting started and his career as a songwriter, producer and drummer continued and uh, he worked uh, with, you know, dozens of major top artists, Don Henley, Stevie Nicks, um, the Mavericks, uh, I mean, he, I could go on and on. Actually, right here, I've got uh, one of his Stevie Nicks awards and one for uh, his work with Don Henley. Uh, over here, and again, these, these are just a few examples of the 37 awards that we have available. This would be from the Tom Petty and the Heartbreakers album. Uh, this is the one that kind of started it all. This would be the first gold record tongue uh, Petty and the Heartbreakers got from their second album. You know, this is back when uh, it was a really big deal for them to sell half a million records. Uh, you can see uh, as things moved along, here is an award for the sale of nine million records for uh, Tom Petty and the Heartbreakers' greatest hits. It's really kind of phenomenal. So in talking to Stan, who by the way really is a really enjoyable guy and a lot of fun to talk to. We do uh, a lot of deep geeking and have some really long conversations about all kinds of musical stuff. In one of those conversations, just somehow his gold records came up and you know he's telling me that the first time he got one, it was a big thrill. I mean, what musician doesn't dream about getting a gold record? But then after that, you know, they just kept coming and the records kept coming and he certainly didn't take them for granted, but it just wasn't really an important thing to him to have these uh, these these plaques. You know, he was uh, more concerned with just making the music. Uh, so literally they started stacking up. So as years go by, uh, Stan has discovered that he gets a lot of kick out of uh, supporting the charities and organizations that he really likes, the individuals that he really likes. He, he likes to be able to do good things. And so he felt that, you know, in selling these, finding new homes would help fans and people appreciate them, get their hands on this stuff, and it would help him fund his many uh, charitable pursuits. So that's what we're doing here today. Uh, this is just a small sample of what uh, what we've got. They're all up on the website at donbennett.com. There's about 37 of them. And uh, yeah, check them out, enjoy. And until the next episode, we'll see you later.